everybody right now is facing the same problem, and that is how to organize your time. What do you do in that time period? And how do you measure your outputs? How do you measure your, your results such that you are gaining momentum, amplifying what you're working on, bringing more value into the moment, and getting closer and closer to your longer term goals that you've set for your life, and then for your year, and then for your week. And so the charts of the inflow matrix, and this is one of them, is to help you to see time in a new way. In this map, we put time in three hour chunks. So each one of these little boxes is one is a three hour chunk, and we have the whole day and the whole week boxed out for you. And so when you're going to design your ideal job, this is a very, very important map. <clears throat> and if you see, it's broken down into five little boxes. And it's PS for personal space, uh, OS for one-on-one -on -one space, GS for group space, CS for community space, and SS for sacred space. And so what that is about is looking at your time and looking at your time allotments and then what kind of space is it? Is it just you? Is it you with somebody else? Is it you in a group? Is it you in the larger community? Or is it you doing your spiritual practice in some manner, either with others or by yourself? And that's the five main distinctions within the inflow matrix operating system of five spaces. Your personal space, your one-on-one -on -one space, your group space, your community space, and your sacred space. And these five spaces are going to be always brought up in terms of how you're going to be organizing by yourself and with other people. And this is just a little reminder about that. 